Cina bereaksi keras atas tindakan Australia yang berencana membeli hingga lima kapal selam bertenaga nuklir dari Amerika Serikat. Menurut Beijing, tindakan ini memicu perlombaan senjata dan merusak perdamaian. Dikutip dari tribunews.com pada 15 Maret, Pejabat Cina menuduh Amerika Serikat dan Inggris mengabaikan kewajiban mereka sebagai kekuatan nuklir, bahkan tak mempedulikan kewajiban mereka sebagai anggota perjanjian non-proliferasi senjata nuklir. Cina menerangkan rencana kerjasama kapal selam nuklir adalah tindakan terang-terangan yang menimbulkan resiko proliferasi nuklir yang serius. Tak hanya itu, tindakan tersebut merusak sistem non-proliferasi internasional, sehingga memicu perlombaan senjata dan merusak perdamaian serta stabilitas di kawasan itu. Dikutip dari laman Rusia Today di San Diego, pada Senin lalu, Presiden Amerika Serikat Joe Biden, Perdana Menteri Inggris Rishi Sunak, dan Perdana Menteri Australia Anthony Albanese menggelar pertemuan. Ketiganya mengumumkan rencana untuk kapal selam kelas baru, yakni SSN AUKUS yang akan dibangun di Inggris dan Australia dengan teknologi dan dukungan Amerika Serikat pada akhir tahun 2030-an atau awal tahun 2040-an. Namun Australia pertama-tama akan membeli setidaknya tiga kapal selam kelas Virginia dari Amerika Serikat. Sejak aliansi AUKUS dibentuk pada tahun 2021, Cina telah berulang kali mengkritik tiga negara itu. Hal ini karena melanggar batas proliferasi nuklir. Kapal selam buatan Amerika Serikat berbahan bakar uranium dan sangat diperkaya tingkat senjata. Cina menyebut rencana transfer teknologi dan material nuklir sebagai buku teks standar ganda. Beijing mendesak tiga negara itu untuk menghormati kewajiban mereka sebagai anggota perjanjian non pro maksud kami proliferasi senjata nuklir. Today in San Diego alongside President Biden and Prime Minister Sunak, I announce the next steps for AUKUS. A new chapter in the friendship between Australia, the US and the UK. Strengthening Australia's national security and providing stability in our region. Building a future made in Australia with record investments in skills, jobs and infrastructure and delivering a superior defence capability into the future. We will partner with the United States and the United Kingdom to build the next generation submarine. They'll be built by Australians, commanded by the Royal Australian Navy and sustained by Australians in Australian shipyards. In the meantime, we'll be training and upskilling our people through increased visits and rotational presence from US and UK submarines. And we'll be purchasing three Virginia-class nuclear-powered submarines from the United States. AUKUS is a historic investment in our people, creating 20,000 direct jobs for Australians in every state and territory, with plans already in place to train workers in South Australia and Western Australia. With construction beginning this decade, we'll train more engineers, scientists, technicians, submariners, administrators and tradespeople. Already, Australian personnel are upskilling on nuclear propulsion technology and stewardship alongside their British and American counterparts. Just as the vision of Curtin and Chifley in creating an automotive industry for Australia in the post-war period helped drive advanced manufacturing, AUKUS is a transformative project for this century. Australia is investing in our defence capability, but also investing in our relationships in the region. This will be a whole of nation effort. It will create opportunities that will shape and strengthen and grow Australia's economy for decades. It will be a catalyst for jobs, for innovation and research. Good jobs with good wages, working to ensure the stability and prosperity of our nations, our region and our world. 